Well, tonight, a story of healing and hope. He was the sole survivor of a deadly attack at the hands of his father. And during the murder trial, he bravely testified about the horrific night his mom and sister were killed. The little boy the public knew as Ronnie is now sharing his story alongside the man and woman he now calls mom and dad. Yes, and Fox 13's Jennifer Holton shows us how they have become a family. Detective Michael Blair knows little Ronnie O'Neill's story has been written for him. He also knows that he doesn't want to be defined by that story. The sole survivor of a murderous rampage that left his mother and sister dead, O'Neill grabbed the attention of the homicide detective on the scene that fateful night. We were told that there was um, one, there was a child being medevaced to Tampa General, but he was not expected to live. But the then eight-year-old did pull through, and when the detective visited him in the hospital, he kind of held onto my hand, and as I left, and he said, "Could you watch a movie with me?" And I said, "No, I can't. I got to go back to work." And I, I said, how about I'll come back and watch a movie with you tonight? When he did return, he brought his wife, Danielle, who says she knew what their family needed to do. I had already known that, that I would want to take Ronnie home with us starting that night. Ronnie still holds on to the memories of his mother and sister. She was nice, pushed me on a swing. She was just a good mom. My sister, she couldn't talk, but she still like could um, move her head and say, like, we used to do sign language. Now 11, and part of this now family of eight, there's another form of communication they've established, a mantra of sorts. And it's, I am safe, I am loved, and I'm part of this family. And he repeats that to himself in moments of stress. It's something that he lives by. Reporting in Tampa, Jennifer Holton, Fox 13 News. Oh. Ronnie was adopted within a year of the March 2018 murders, and he now has five brothers and sisters with the Blair family. Ronnie says he hopes to one day pursue a career in acting.